got to take out today? Our cake that's been in like five different freezers. It's the top tier, it finally got to come out. Yay, our pretty cake. We're both pretty excited that we finally get to eat this because it's just been sitting there for a year. Oh my gosh, guys, I've been married for a year. That's crazy. And you know, it's so funny because we've been together now for five and a half years. It doesn't feel like super crazy. Like, oh my gosh, we made it to the year mark. Like, we made it to the year mark in terms of uh, people realizing that we are legally married. <laughs> um, but no, yeah, we're, we're both excited. We're gonna, we're gonna go celebrate tonight. Uh, nothing too crazy because we got uh, we got a lot of stuff coming up uh, for the rest of this year. Uh, we're going to Ohio soon to see my family um, and have a little mini vacation. Uh, so, oh, and we're going out to Oregon for a friend's wedding. So we can't do anything super crazy this year, but we're hoping next year we'll be able to do something. I'm already planning a couple things in the back of my head. Um, but I got my honeymoon last year, which means we got to take a break this year uh, and just celebrate at home. But uh, we're both really happy. We're both very excited. And uh, I'm kind of debating right now if I want to go to the gym or not. Now, the reason I wouldn't want to go to the gym is because uh, I kind of want to go get my hair cut. Uh, it's gotten really long, so uh, I think I might go get it cut. Um, and... We're gonna go celebrate tonight, so I wanna get it done before that. Uh, so I think I'm gonna skip the gym and I'll go on Wednesday and Friday and then try to make up not going today on like Tuesday or Thursday. Or I'll just come home and take Bombi for a walk when uh, when I get my hair cut. So it's just like, it's starting to get, like my hair's so thick, it's starting to get really hot whenever I go on events outside. So I think I'm gonna do it, guys. I think so. It's a little too much for me to handle right now. Well, hello. My pets are so mean to each other. What's up guys, I'm here in the studio. Um, kind of taking a little bit of a break day. Uh, I'm not as focused on editing the podcast, but I got all my work done for the station, so now I'm just chilling, uh, listening to some Darius Rucker. Kind of sad I had to miss him in concert, but you know, you do what you got to. Uh, it was it was a little hot on, on Saturday. Just chilling out. Um, I'm probably gonna edit the vlog as soon as I get home so that uh, Cody and I can enjoy the night and then I won't have to worry about it. Uh, I'll film more of whatever we're doing and uh, get that up tomorrow, so. Uh, I'm sure there'll be more clips today. I gotta show off Bombadil. He's uh, he's the cute one that everybody wants to see anyway. Hey guys, so I just got out of the uh, great clips. Got my hair cut. Oh my gosh, it feels so good. So freaking good to have it off my neck. Oh my gosh. I, I didn't even realize really until I was driving around like how long it had gotten. And I tell you what, the biggest thing I hear now that I'm an adult from anybody who ends up cutting my hair is you have so much crap in hair. That is verbatim what the girl said today. And she kept saying, she's like, God, you've got so much hair. Oh my gosh. And that was after she cut it. And I was like, oh, I am so sorry. Oh my gosh, I feel bad. But I mean, it's that's why I gotta get it cut. I gotta gotta keep it, keep it loose, because it's so heavy that, you know, I just all over my neck and just hurt. It's just hot. It's hot, but hopefully I'll start being cooler now that I have my hair cut. It was actually really, really nice. I got a lot of compliments on my color and they kept asking me like, what is, what is that? Like what color, what brand is that? And I was like, oh, the, the grocery store brand. <laughs> The like one purple that the grocery store brand has that was, you know, like an actual color and not um, not like a party color. So, yeah, but that was very sweet of them. I really appreciated that. And uh, I'm going to super enjoy this haircut. So every time I've come home recently, Griffin has been on the couch and Bombadil has been on the floor. 
Now, I don't know if that means that Griffin has just claimed the couch as hers, or uh, if Bombadil just jumped off to say hi to me when he heard the garage door. Um, if you've claimed the couch, that's super mean. You're a mean cat. She's like, screw off, I need to bathe. Okay guys, this is where I'm gonna end the vlog for today because uh, I have to go get ready for my date tonight. Yay! Ugh, I keep playing with my hair because I love it so short. It's so much fun. And I get hair in my face. <laughs> ah, all right, we're ending the vlog here because I gotta go get ready and I gotta edit this real quick so I don't have to worry about it tonight. All right, bye! Bye.